Hello everybody, my name's Ralph. Are you ready for some story and singing? Uh oh, there's Bertie wanting to come in the room. In a minute, hey Ralph, shall we sing the hello song? One, two, three. Hello Michelle, hello Ralph, hello everyone, it's nice to see you here. Oh, Bertie and Ralph have just seen a blackbird in the garden, so hopefully he won't bark. Can you see him looking? Off goes the blackbird so I can put Ralph down now. Are you ready for our first song? It's got a hill in it and two characters, one called Jack and one called Jill. Are you ready? One, two, three. Jack and Jill went up the hill to fetch a pail of water. Jack fell down and broke his crown and Jill came tumbling after. Up Jack got and home did trot as fast as he could caper. He went to bed and bound his head with vinegar and brown paper. Vinegar and brown paper? When I was a little girl and I bumped my head, my mummy never put vinegar and brown paper on me. She put a plaster. I wonder why vinegar and brown paper? I don't know. A hill is that shape. It's an arched shape. And when you've been out doing your walks, have you noticed in people's windows, there are lots of things that are that shape. They're called a rainbow. Have you seen all the rainbows? I thought I could tell you a story about lots of different colors, and then maybe we could sing the rainbow song. You'll have to help me because I keep getting it wrong. So my story's all in my head because I heard it years and years and years ago, but it's stuck a bit in there, so hopefully it's all gonna come out just right. A long, long time ago, way before even I was born, there was a village, and at the bottom of the village, all of the villagers lived, at the top of a hill lived a wise man in his house, and everything in this world was gray. The houses were gray, the sky was gray, the grass was gray, Everything was grey and it was known as the great greyness. Well, one day the wise man thought, because wise men always think a lot, and he thought, this is very boring. I need to see if I can change things. So he went down into his cellar and he opened up his special box of wonderful things and he started to mix all the potions and lotions that he could until all of a sudden there was a great big poof <gasps> and he made a colour. Can you think what colour this is? Is it orange? No. Is it green? No, it's blue. He made blue. So he painted his house blue. Oh, there it is, look, blue. Everything in his house is blue. And the villagers looked up the hill and they said, oh, Oh, wise man, we would love to paint our homes that colour. Can we have some of that paint? And the wise man said yes. And they took it down and they painted everything. They painted the plates blue, the cups blue. They painted their sheds blue. You name it, they painted it blue. And it was known as the Great Blueness. Ooh. Well, after a while, everyone, after seeing so much blue all the time, they began to feel so blue, because when you feel blue, I'll be all right in a minute. Oh, when you feel blue, you're really, really sad. And well, the wise man couldn't cope with it any longer, and he got really upset. It's okay, Ralph, I'm not sad, really. And, oh, well, he decided that he was gonna go back into his cellar, so he did. And he mixed together all the potions and lotions, and all of a sudden there was a great big poof. And he made another color. Look, oh, wow, look at that color. What color is this one? Can you see it? Is it green? No, it's, yeah, well done, it's red. So he painted his house red. Everything was red in his house, even his sandwiches. 
Well, the villagers saw that and they said, please, wise man, can we have some of your red paint, please? And the wise man said, yes. So they painted everything red. They painted the sky red. They painted the trees red. They even painted the flowers red. And it was known as the great redness. Well, do you know what happens when you feel red and you see red? Because when you see red, it makes you really, really angry and grumpy and cross. And everyone started to have arguments and be really cross with one another. And it wasn't nice to hear. And even the wise man on top of his hill began to feel really, 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 really cross. And he said, I can't stand this any longer. And he went down into his cellar and he started to mix something else. He mixed all his potions and lotions until all of a sudden he had a great big poof and there was another colour. Are you ready? <gasps> he made a brand new colour. Can you see it? You can. What's this one called? Yes, you're right. Yellow. He made yellow. Isn't it a beautiful colour? So he painted everything yellow. Oh, it's so pretty. Look at that. Everything in his home was yellow. And the villagers said, can we paint our world yellow, please? Oh, and we let them do it. They painted the doors yellow. They painted the floors yellow. They even painted the cars yellow. Don't do that in real life. It's only a story. And it was known as the great yellowness. Well, you think that would be the end of my story, but it's not. Because do you know what happens if you see too much yellow? You get the most terrible don't you, Ralph? You get the most terrible, terrible headache. You really do. You get a terrible headache. Oh, and even Ralph had a headache. Oh, but, did you know, it was so bad, they could hardly open their eyes, even with their sunglasses on. So, the wizard went back up to his hill, and he thought, hmm, I'm going to have to do some more mixing. Can you help me do some more mixing, Ralph? And he mixed together two colours. He mixed together red and yellow. Do you know what colour you make if you mix red and yellow? Ralph does. Ralph, can you pick it up for me? <gasps> Yay! Good boy! You get orange. Good boy! Because red and yellow make orange. Oh, I'm going to move these all over a bit now. All over a little bit to here because we're going to make a whole rainbow of colours. Red and yellow makes orange. Look at that. Isn't that pretty? <gasps> Red and orange and yellow. And then he carried on mixing and he mixed a little bit of the blue and the yellow. And do you know what happens if he mix blue and yellow? You get Yay, you're right! You get this colour. What's this colour called? It's called green. <gasps> Look at that lovely colour, green. But he still hasn't finished. He thought, oh, I can get another colour out of this if I try really hard. And he mixed two more colours. Oh, what colour's mixing? Um, oh, I don't know. What colour is missing? Uh-oh. Oh no, I've lost my end. Let me see if I can fix it back on. Give me a second. Oh dear. Oh no. <laughs> uh oh, that went a bit wrong. My rainbow fell on the floor. Oh no, what a shame. But when that happens, look what happened to my rainbow. A new colour appeared because of the red and the blue mixed together. Can you see what colour has appeared? Pardon? You are very clever. If you mix red and blue, you get purple. You're right, you do get purple. And just because I like it, I'm gonna add another colour. It's this one. What's this colour called? It's called pink. We've made a whole rainbow. Now, all the villagers decided that they wanted to paint their whole world all of the colours. So 
So they did. They used all the colours in the rainbow and they painted everything different. And it looks like our world because our world's all different colours. When you're next out having your walk, have a look and see in people's windows if you can see any rainbows. And see if you can count how many. It could be more than five. It could be more than ten. And maybe you could draw or paint or make your very own rainbow to put in your window. Very excited. When I take my dogs out for a walk, I'm going to look really carefully. Shall we sing the rainbow song? I get this one wrong a lot. So I'm sorry if it goes wrong. You're going to have to bear with me. You're going to have to help me because normally people are singing with me. So I'm going to try my hardest for the rainbow song. And we've got lots of different colours. We've got red and we've got yellow and we've got pink and we've got green. We've got purple. My favourite sign is orange. Like you're squeezing an orange to your lips. Squeeze an orange and blue. Are you ready to sing a rainbow? One, two, three. Red and yellow and pink and green, purple and orange and blue. I can sing a rainbow, sing a rainbow, sing a rainbow too. Listen with your eyes, listen with your eyes and sing everything you see. I can sing a rainbow, sing a rainbow, sing along with me. Red and yellow and pink and green purple and orange and blue. I can sing a rainbow, sing a rainbow, sing a rainbow too. I can't wait to see all your rainbows. I'm very, very excited. You could even build them from Lego or anything else that you can find. Maybe you could find lots of material like I did and make your own rainbow and hang it up. Or maybe you could do some gluing and sticking to make a rainbow and you can add all your favourite shades and colours in too. Shall we sing the goodbye song together? Are you ready? Yes? One, two, three. Oh, it's time to say goodbye to all our friends. Oh, it's time to say goodbye to all our friends. Oh, it's time to say goodbye, time to say goodbye, time to say goodbye to all our friends. Singing I, I, yippee, yippee, I, yee-haw! Singing I, I, yippee, yippee, I, woo-hoo! Singing I, I, yippee, I, I, yippee, I, I, yippee, yippee, I, go!